Hello Pisces and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So Pisces I am here to check in and see what's going on with your energy in the month of March right? Um, this reading is for the collective so it may or may not resonate with you. Just take what does resonate and toss out the rest. And um, thank you Pisces for all of your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing. Thank you so, so much for all of your support. All right, Pisces, let's cut the deck and see what's going on in your month of March, right? Ooh, well, oh, geez. Okay, hello. That's some heavy energy, I got to say. Um, I, I, I kind of get the feeling I'm dealing with the masculine Pisces here. Or this could, ju could just be your person, Pisces. Take it how it resonates, though, guys, okay? I feel like there's a masculine here that feels very betrayed. I feel like they got betrayed somewhere where they chose um, over you. Okay, let's just say that. I'm just going to say that this is your person's energy, okay? Flip and reverse the roles if you have to. But there's a masculine here that's feeling like ten swords in the back. This is man down. This is extreme pain, right? They've been so betrayed it can't be undone, okay? Um, and I feel like it was done by whoever... Uh, is somebody out here getting married? Oh, they're showing me this video about some guy who is, like, I guess apparently doesn't know Rihanna, but the, some dude flipped out somewhere about Rihanna being pregnant, okay? And that's kind of the feeling that I'm getting here. I get, I'm kind of getting the feeling, Pisces, like there's someone out here getting married or... Um, maybe engaged or something building with somebody else and somebody's crying about it they feel kind of betrayed here by that there may be a really awesome new guy and they're out in the cold here watching somebody else come in because it took this person too long they walked away from you they walked away from you. It took them too long to come forward, okay? I feel like they wanted, they maybe wanted to come forward at some time. I feel like they were in a third-party situation. They were with someone else. They chose someone else, walked away from you, or you walked away from them because it took them too long to come in, okay? Now they're out in the cold. They could be having financial issues. I feel like you're going to hear from this person maybe during a celebration time, too, regarding this. Wow, soulmate connection here. You're going to be shining bright. Somebody's going to reach out to you, Pisces. Someone's going to reach out to you. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, but I kind of, I, I feel like you're going to be, you're just in the spotlight. What are you out celebrating with friends? You've met someone new. Um, I feel like you guys are meeting someone new, or you could be getting married, or somebody's getting married here maybe, and you're out celebrating it. Okay, Pisces? And this person who's out in the cold, they want to come and talk to you here. They want to talk to you. Now, they're wondering to themselves, do I really, do I have anything to really offer Pisces, okay? What do I have to offer Pisces? Because this is really beginning stage stuff. Now, this is a page coming towards you, and you have somebody here who, who's been through a battle, much like your own, and who is uh, victorious through it, Okay. Um, this is, I feel like this is somebody new. This is somebody new. And I, you guys could be getting married or something really fast. And it's making this person feel very stabbed in the back. Like, they don't have a reason to feel this way, though. They don't. You're living your life. I feel like you walked away from this person maybe because they were taking too long. They were waiting for some kind of ships to come in. I don't know what. 
their situation kept getting worse and worse. Yeah, now they're coming forward. They don't have a whole lot to offer, and you are on your way to celebrating a new occasion here in your life. You're in the spotlight right now, being very loving, very healing. I feel like they want to heal this with you. I feel like you will handle this with this person well. But, uh, yeah, they're about to reach out, and I... Looking at somebody who could be getting committed here or engaged or something to somebody new, somebody much more stable. Um, yeah, this person's a page, they're coming at you with it. Yeah. This person, I feel like they they are still in some kind of other third party situation where now they're they're like this, okay? They're kicking rocks because the one that they really want is and who are in, who they're in love with is getting snatched up and and engaged maybe to somebody else or married. Take it how it resonates. And now they're really upset. Okay, because now they're out in the cold, in bad health, probably dirt poor or having financial issues, right? Immature, they don't have a whole lot to offer because they're still connected to somebody else. The person that they chose over you. See, there they are right there. Followed them right out into the cold. But I feel like they want to come towards you anyway. They want to clean up. See, they've got to clean up a little bit, straighten up, right? They got to clean up, and then they're going to come forward. They're going to buy this polka dotted shirt and a pair of tights. And then they're going to come forward and talk to you. I feel like you are going to be very sweet, very caring, very considerate, very loving, okay? But um, you've got other things going on up here. That's your main focus, I feel. Yeah, Empress energy. Empress, you're an Empress now. You're in the Empress throne here, about to be with an Emperor, I feel. Okay? And you're out here partying. You're out here having a great time. I don't know who this is for, so... Being a star, you're in the spotlight right now, especially. Okay? And this person's going to be really sad because I feel like, I feel like they, they think they've put a lot of work into something here. They really wanted this new beginning with you. They may feel like they don't have enough to offer you. They're going to feel sad. But you're, um, you're celebrating something new for yourself here. Pisces in the month in the month of March they're seeing it you've got an, a new boyfriend you've got a new like you, you could even be getting engaged or married here yeah you've got an emperor you're gonna have an emperor here coming in March or maybe even getting committed to one to an emperor in March this is a this is and your person is this right now. And you're getting this in a new person in March. An emperor to an empress. This is a power couple. This could lead to a marriage proposal. Building a solid foundation. And your person, they worked on something that really they wasted a lot of time and effort in. They are not going to be able to take these pentacles. They're going to have to have a new beginning, but I feel like you're going to choose the emperor over this person. This is somebody, like I said, they've been through the same kind of battle, the same kind of journey you have, and they've come out of it much the same way with a victory like you. This is a person here who's done the work on themselves. You're going to be getting an emperor in. If you haven't already met this person, you'll probably meet them in March. For whoever this is resonating with. And your person, they're not feeling like an emperor. You know why? Because they chose the devil. They chose to put their effort, their effort and time into something toxic. 
You put your effort and time into you. Okay. Yeah. All right. Give me one more. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. There. Bottom of the deck. Bottom of the deck. Yeah. It, ten, of, ten of cups. This is the... This is like the kind of life that everybody dreams of having. This is what's coming towards you right now. Okay? Now the other card on the bottom, the next card on the bottom of the deck is the Hermit card. This person, they're going to this could have been your twin flame here. They're going to be burdened about this for for the rest of their days. For the rest of their days, they slept on this. They're feeling kind of betrayed because um you're getting somebody new here. But they slept on this. You moved on. And now they're, the light is being shined on everything that, you know, they should have made this choice. This could have been the ultimate dream life. They see it clearly in March. I'm telling you, they're going to be very, very burdened while you move forward and become um, a power couple with a new emperor. Wow, that's a really, that's good. I'm not touching it after this. This is really good. Pisces, great reading. Yes, that's what I like. Anyway, Pisces, it's going to be a very um, good month for you. You're, you're going to be celebrating something. You're going to be teaming up here with an emperor. Um, and you're going to be entering into this dream life. I mean, come on. I feel like someone is going to approach you from your past. You know what? You're going to handle it with kindness. You're going to handle it with kindness and move forward. Yeah. Good going, Pisces. Yes. All right, Pisces, listen. That's been your really quick March reading. Um, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. I do. I really do because this is a really good reading. Okay. <laughs> it is. It's really, really good. Um yeah, so if you like this video, click that like button. Give me a big fat thumbs up, right? And um, if, uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe if you like this vibe. And if this is resonating with you, right, become a new Mooney. And until next time, Pisces, take care of you and peace out.